Here lies Ophelia, tragically drowned, daughter, sister, human. What do you mean, human? Oh my- Yo, what is going on, YouTube? Spruce Lee here. And in today's video, we're going to be playing a game called Crow County. Now, I've seen some clips of this game on YouTube. This shit looks fire. It's like a Resident Evil 2 style game. You know, we have the camera above you and it's like looking down on you. Dude. This shit looks cool. So, I'm hyped to play it. You know, if y'all want a full series on this, let me know. I kind of want to do one, because this game looks cool, bro. But without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into the episode. 2024? This year? Oh, shit, never mind. Damn. The 90s. Ooh, I'm so hyped. If anyone asks... My name is Mara. Mara Forest. Ooh, Mara Forest. Special Agent Forest. Oh shit, never mind. You're like, that's me. Don't forget it. Jill Valentine. Don't mess it up. She's part of Stars. <laughs> she kind of looks like Jill too. I've seen. And doesn't she wear a blue shirt? I'm pretty sure she wears a blue shirt. I'm not gonna lie. Well, we finna find out. Hello? Oh, shit. I thought my game crashed. She does not wear a blue shirt. I lied, guys. Oh, this game looks tough. It looks tough. Okay. Yes. Yes, science! Oh my god, that's how you aim? Yep. <laughs> go ahead and turn the settings up. Aiming speed, yep. There we go. What does that feel like? Oh yeah, that's way better. I mean, kind of better. Private property, keep out. What are we doing here? Oh shit, what the hell? Oh, it's water, okay. Is there like a save? There's no save. Okay. So I'm fucked. That's what I'm getting at. Can I shoot? Okay. Is that blood? That is definitely blood. What the hell? What was that? It's the trunk of the car. Okay, examine. EL Crow? What? Use ID? What? Hold on. Yeah, no shit, it doesn't work. It's an ID card. Is there a key? It's a wheel. The hubcaps are solid gold. Uh, what a show off. Yeah, that's true. If you got gold hubcaps, you're just begging to get your shit stolen. It's a trunk of my car. There's something important stored in here. Yeah, let's open it. My box of ammo! Yes, you should stock up. Obtained handgun ammo. Okay. Alright, you have enough. Okay, okay, so I'm guessing that's like a, if you want to go back and... Oh shit. Okay. If you want to go back and get some ammo, you can later. Can I shoot this lock? Oh, shoot, you can! Is that like a sprint? Wait, she was sprinting. There we go. Okay. You have enough. Okay. Okay. Alright. I get it, I guess. I'm guessing we gotta find a key or something for that, for that car. I don't know. Ticket booth. I have no intention of buying a ticket. Why not? <gasps> Flashlight. Yep. Take that. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What is this? It's a diagram of the video game controller? What controller? Oh. <laughs> Come on, bro. Okay. Where are we at? What the hell is with this music? What's going on? I don't want to shoot it because I don't know what's going to happen. 
I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna leave it. Okay, okay, oh, oh, okay. Good evening. Oh, okay. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, this game, bro. I can already tell this game's gonna freak me out. Long middle gate, no entry. It's locked, there's a silver keyhole. Okay, I can't use an ID. Oh my god! Jesus. Fuck! There's something wrong with the ventilator in the fairy bond area. We think something might have crawled into the pipe and died. Don't run the ventilator, and if you do, hold your breath seriously. So, don't run the ventilator. Because if you do, you're, you're cooked. It's locked. Cool. Okay. No gift shop. It's locked. There's a bronze keyhole. I don't have anything for it. How about the bathroom? Okay. Let's go in the bathroom. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is this? It's a laser sight from a handgun? Ooh, yeah. Ooh. That just gets me feeling a certain way. Sorry, my bad. My bad. What is this? Is that ammo? What? Why is there ammo in there? Oh, it's got a laser sight in there so I can aim better. Oh my god, oh my god, run. I gotta get this control down, bro. It's a magazine. What is that sound? Beyond Magazine, August 1987. Strange sighting at abandoned theme park. Aspiring paranormal photographer Arthur Mole sent in a Polaroid he took while exploring in the abandoned amusement park in Crow County. Could this thing possibly be real or is it just another hoax? Here at the Beyond Magazine, we are not convinced. Try a little harder next time, Arthur. Okay, cool. Oh, what the fuck is that? What is that? Okay, hold on. Oh my god. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're leaving. Okay. It's a mini machine. I don't have any change on me. Oh, okay. A med kit. In a vending machine at an amusement park. I'm taking everything! Kick it! Aw, oh, man. Kick it! I hear something. See, so tell me that rolling sound effect is just there. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. What are we doing again? We're looking for something. Do I need to shoot this? I feel like I need to shoot that. Oh my god. Okay. What what did that do? Oh, there's like there's a mickey in there. I see that. I'm not shooting it. Nope. We're good right now. We have enough ammos and stuffs. Shotgun shells. Low key, we might want to leave that. I'm not gonna. Lie. How do you drop shit? Can you not drop shit? What is this? Yeah, leave it, leave it, leave it. It's a trash can. Full of trash. Reach in. A med kit. There's a. That bitch is nasty. I don't give a fuck though. I'm using it. Oh, you can stack stuff! I didn't even realize that until I opened it. I'm a dumbass. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Give me that. A large med kit. Wow. So you got a fat ass med kit. You got a regular med kit. Nobody I can call. Okay. What's up, bird? Hello, Mr. Crow. I'm looking for your boss. Do you know where he is? <laughs> Alright, fuck you too then, bitch. What do you want? It's a fortune telling machine? How does this place still have power? You have 10 credits remaining. Would you like to hear your fortune? Uh, yes. Come on up. Nine? 
talk to the tree fairy to enter the fairy pond. How is that a fortune? That's just you telling me something to do, dickhead. Okay. Um. It's locked. There's a bronze keyhole. I have this key card. Oh, I keep going forward. I'm a dickhead. Fairy tale town. I know these trash cans sometimes have shit in them. Please don't kill me. Okay, we're good. 2106. That's definitely a code to something. 2106, yeah. I think it's written in blood. Is it a code for something? Obviously. Um, what are these barrels? I feel like I have to shoot one for the one time. I definitely have to. Oh, there's a lot of sway on my bitch. Oh, okay. Damn. I'm a dumbass. I should have known that was going to happen. Oh, that's a bear trap. Okay. Okay. What in the fuck? What in fuck's name is that? Come on, bro. <clears throat> a Polaroid camera. Is that a dead person? You good, bro? Sir, what happened here? What? Who? My name is Mara Forrest. I'm here to help. They attacked me. All I wanted was proof. Proof of what? What's your name? Arthur Mole. I just needed a better, a clearer photo. Photo of what? Who attacked you, Arthur? Those things, I don't know, bro. <laughs> he got the photo, what is that thing? Those people, they saw me in. All right, stay calm, you're you're bleeding quite bad. All right, uh, can I just give him a make it? Oh shit, okay. Handgun ammo, I ain't gonna ask twice. Yep. All right, what was your name again? I can't remember. You stay there, sir. Oh shit. Nope. You can, you can go ahead and count me out. <laughs> yeah, we're not doing that bullshit. We'll go find a different place to go through. A big door. Okay. Locked. Let's go up here. Yeah. Yeah. What in the fuck? What is this? There's a hole in the fence. I can reach the edge of the water. Okay, what does that do? It's a newspaper. The Atlanta Globe, May 1986. Crow County theme park opening soon. Cancel your weekend plans with the new in-laws and grab your sunglasses. A brand new theme park is opening just a few miles southeast of Atlanta. Explore fairy tale town, haunted hilltop, an ocean kingdom at Crow County, which promises a day full of fun and adventure for the whole family. This shit is not, yeah, come on, bro. The park is owned by one Mr. Edward Crow, a lifelong Atlanta local and landowner. Yes, that's right. It appears he named the park after himself. Dickhead. Not much is known about Mr. Crow other than the vague... Oh shit, that's a big ass word. Unsubstantiated, <laughs> unsubstantiated. Damn, I'm good at this shit. Is this reports that he is exceptionally wealthy? Nonetheless. <laughs> None of the less. Nonetheless, we look forward to seeing what Mr. Crow County has to offer when it opens its gates this summer. Okay. So I only butchered about half of it. It's a staff memo. <laughs> if a swan breaks down, just take the egg out of its wheel system. Doing so disables the radio signal and, and uh, locks the wheel until you can get a mechanic out to fix it. Okay, so what swan... 
Oh, I need a swan over here. Okay. It's a wheel. It doesn't turn. There's a strange mechanical swan head. Do I need something to put in its mouth? Probably. Oh, what is this? It's been broken. I wouldn't know how to repair it. Yeah, that's not good. So the eggs are going missing. I think the kids are stealing them. Luckily, it turns out you can use anything as long as it's about the right size and shape. It's weird. I'd assume that the eggs were magnetic or something, but apparently not. Okay, so anything that's like... The shape? I don't know. So obviously, we're not ready for this. Yeah, we're missing something. So I'm supposed to get one of them swans to me, I'm, I'm guessing. And then... I don't know. i fucking do something with it. <sighs> I'm dreading this. Because I know where I have to go. Oh! 2106! How did I not see that? What the fuck is a zero? What? Leave it? Wait. 21... Not six? What? Wait, bro, I thought I had it. It's a four number code. Two one zero six. It's a code for something. What the hell is that? Oh. Oh. I pressed the wrong button again. Oh, shit. Does that hurt me? No, it doesn't. Okay. Does that give me a zero? No, the fuck it doesn't. Okay. I think there's only one place left we can go. Oh, there's a big ass medkit. I saw that. Yep, give me that bitch. Who is this? Hold up. Old cigarettes machine. I'm not allowed to smoke. How the? How old are you? What the fuck? Oh, maybe it's because she's like in that community or whatever. Not in that community. I'm a fucking dickhead. Holy shit. In that, uh. Oh! <gasps> Headshot, bitch. Headshot, bitch. Bro, die! Oh, shit! Oh, my God, oh, my God. I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Reload the blicky. Shit. Is it dead? But stop pressing that button. Is it... Is this like Resident Evil? Do they... <laughs> Smells so bad, like an infected wound. I feel bad for killing it, but I leave it... I feel bad for leaving it alive too. I have one bullet. Ah. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I knew there was something down here. I fucking knew it. <laughs> Can I go to my car and get some more ammunition? I don't want to go all the way back. Okay. Let's see what the hell's in here. Please don't be another one. Oh. Oh. Okay. It's a magazine. Let's read that bitch. Oh. Okay, never mind. Fuck me too. Then. It's a letter. State Court, 185 Central Avenue, SW. That was SW. Atlanta, GA. I don't know. I might be a dumbass. Hey, yeah. 3033. So, 30303. United States legal summonings. Oh, it's Atlanta, Georgia. <sighs> Fuck me, man. Dear Mr. Crow, I am writing to you in the relation to the incident which occurred within your theme park in July of 1988. So this is two years ago, I guess. As you know, a 15-year-old girl by the name of Elaine Marshall was injured. The incident occurred within your premises and within working hours. As such, the Marshall's family is holding you personally responsible. Ooh, shit. 
Your presence is required in court. We expect to hear from you immediately. Sincerely, G. Williams, State Court. I'm going to say his name is Greg Williams. No, I'm not going to say that. Oh, there's something in there, but I can't break it because I only have one. Oh, yeah. You know what? I got one bullet left. Stop pressing that button. I got one bullet left. It doesn't matter. One bullet for more ammo. See, listen. If this isn't a life lesson, I don't know what is. Sometimes you got to give up more than you can offer for more in return. sorry it's a ring bound book a collection of staff memos how big is a collection damn 10 pages Whew, lock in there's something wrong with the ventilator in the fairy pond area we think something might have crawled in there into the pipe and died don't run the ventilator. If you do, hold your breath seriously. Oh no, this is a collection of things I've already read. Okay. Whew, so I had to tweak for a minute. Thought I had to read again. And uh, from my past videos, I think I'll know that my reading skills are not the best. From a 1 to 10, I'd give it like a 3. Alright, what are these? Page from a magazine. Megabyte magazine tips and tricks. What the humanoid enemies will take more damage if you get a headshot? Oh, oh, so it's like a tip within the game. A headshot also has a chance of decapitating decap 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 some enemies. Okay, bet. Megabyte magazine tips and tricks. When shooting, your bullets will do more damage if you hit, or if you're close to the enemy. Oh. So attempting to shoot enemies from far away will use your ammo supplies more quickly. Yeah, that sucks. So you gotta tell me I gotta be up in the grill. What the hell? Are, what the fuck? What is this? Oop, trash can. Give me that make it. And I don't. Oh, is it like there's poison? Kind of like you have to use a blue herb in Resident Evil. <gasps> Kick that bitch. Ammo came out. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm talking about. What do we got? Uh, no. What What do we got? Come on. Man, fuck you, vending machine. What is this? Hey, Ed. Want some good news? I finally found a good site for our gold mine. It's in Para. Northern Brazil? What? Just like we wanted. There's this, uh, disused mine here. The locals gave up on it years ago. It's still in this, uh, decent shape. So it shouldn't be too much work to get it into looking the part. Marv. Summer 1990. Oh, they were like doing some, some work back here. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Alright. Got a little more handgun ammo. Um, I feel like there was something I was supposed to do back in here. Why the hell did Mari just text me saying, can I milk you? Pause! Oh, is this like the safe room? I just realized this is like the safe room, I think. Did I already read this? I don't think so. Remember to get into the fairy pond area. Say this out loud to the fairy. Hear me, oh great fairy of fairiest forest. It's pretty sensitive. It won't work if you have an accent. Sorry, Diego. Damn! Okay, so hear me, oh great fairy of fairiest forest. Okay. So we need to go, we need to go to that fairy thingy, whatever it's called, I think. Oh, I forgot we're back here, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my God. Are they chill? They're not chill. Sit down, bitch. Oh, you're still alive. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We're good. We're good. Whew. Okay. 
Okay. We made it out. All right, now we gotta go find that, this thing. Yes, this. Is this a door? I can't find it. I see a way to open it. Say the, the passcode. You have to say it. Say the passcode. What was the passcode again? Hold on. It's not in there. Uh, was it in here? No, it wasn't there. Yeah, let's see. Hear me, O oh great fairy of fairious forest. Hear me, O oh great fairy of fairious forest. Now I'm about to go try something. Guys, don't, 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 don't call me a dumbass if this doesn't work. <clears throat> Hear me, O oh great fairy of fairious forest. I don't understand why you even did this to yourself. This made you look so fucking stupid. This shit make you look so stupid. Oh, a little house. There's a keyhole. Little post box. Bronze keyhole. I don't have the keys. Okay. If you look for the machine chain, one on the swan boat, people took it to fix the broken swan. I told them not to take it, and they took it anyway. You can't reason with the swan boat people. Okay, swan boat people. <laughs> Here at Crow Country, we can't. Yes, guys. I didn't know it was country. I was saying county the whole time. Okay, don't flame me. We can't wait to share our optimistic visions of the future with you, Douglas Pike Park Operations. Okay. Oh yeah, take that map. Take that map. I wonder what kind of wondrous things await us in the future, Edward Crow, park owner. Yeah, nothing good. Just be emoji, bro. It's a hole in the fence. Done with wire cutters. I think this is how Arthur got in. Cut into the fence. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is the fairy. She's facing another way. Okay. What's in there? Box of handgun ammo. Yep. There we go. So we're talking about. Now I can maybe can I set this off without getting myself cooked. Okay. There we go. Nice. Um, come on. I think we should take you or take a look at your leg. I can't leave him like this. Give him healing on him. Yeah, we'll give you healing on him. We'll give you just one of them regular bandages. Yeah. Thanks. I still feel kind of bad. Come on, let's move. Get you somewhere safe. You don't look too heavy. Come on, Arthur. We'll take you to that safe room in there. Sorry, I'm getting some of my uh, sweet tea from Kate's. All right, moving to the car. He'll be safe there for now. Okay. Were you hiding something in that big ass barrel you were laying on, Arthur? What's that? Note on the floor, tree lady, three one eight four. Tree lady. Is this her? No. Who's tree lady? Oh! 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 Oh my god. Oh, okay. What is it? This. Okay, hold on, hold on. What the fuck is that? Okay. What are you, like a brainiac? Bitch. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay! Dog. I ain't got enough ammo. Why does it sound like that? I'm in caution. Can I buy some ammo or something? Maybe I need, I need to go back to my car. Let's get back to the car. Oh shit, 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 shit. Oh, there's so... What, what happened? There's gonna be stuff back here. Please. Please let me stuff back here. Okay, I think we go back here. 
Oh, there's handgun ammo. Yep. Take it. Come on, boy. Come here, Brady. What are you like? That fucking shit they get at the, uh. What's it called with the peanut and SpongeBob? Oh, why do you sound like that? Bro, they look like a burn victim. Oh, anyways, what I was talking about with those things is they like they're like uh the goofy goober milkshakes from SpongeBob. So if I go back to my car, is Arthur gonna be there? We're gonna go find out. Okay, Arthur's in there. Nice. Yep. There we go. Okay, so you can just always come back if you need some ammo. That's good. Because I was cooked if I couldn't do that. Staff memo. The quickest way to uh, Tall Man's office is through the fairy pond area, rat. Problem is, I forgot how the stupid tree fairy. Or I forgot how to get the stupid tree fairy to move out of the way. I guess I need the code for the keypad and then. Oh, 3184. Okay. There we go. Ooh, what the hell? Okay. Oh, here we go. Hear me, oh great fairy of fairiest forest. There we go. Hear me, oh, yep. Move, please. <gasps> will you protect our precious natural world? Uh, yes, I will. Follow me. Okay, bet. Let's go. Ooh, yeah. New area. New area, everybody. Oh. Ooh, hell no. I don't know about <gasps> The eggs! Uh, okay. Those who seek the truth stare into the pure reflective water of our fairy pond. I don't think I'm gonna see shit. Read the gameplay tips posted on the walls around the Crow Country. And every say, yeah, we already we've read this multiple times. There's an antidote back there. Antidote. I still don't know what that does. I think it's a poison. Ventilator override. Do not touch. Oh, okay. Oh. No. Leave it. It's a valve. Tighten it. Oh, that hurts. Note. So the guy who fixed the water filter did it by running it through the air ventilation system. If you run the, uh, the filter pump behind the curtain with the uh, incorrect pressure too high or too low, it will trigger the ventilator. Be careful. You can tighten up the pressure using the valve handle. So we have to run the filter pump. What's my health? We're okay for me being a jackass. Okay. Behind the curtain, flip that. So where's this curtain at? What the fuck? Who took the Ocean Kingdom restaurant trident? That thing is expensive. And without it, we can't do the Happy Birthday Sea Monster song. Someone said they saw it in the Witchwood. I'd go check, but that place gives me the creeps, honestly. Alright. Is that like a melee button in this game? I want to keep wasting my bullets if there's nothing in these. Oh, there is some! Okay, so at least we know we can get some out of them now. It's going to be on very rare car car uh, occurrences, though. Damn, I can't tell. Shotgun shells. Okay, I guess we'll take them. Watch out for middle bear traps lying around on the ground. We can't set them off from a, sta or from a safe distance with a single handgun bullet. Or you can, I mean. I guess. What we got in the trash? I make it. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and use one. Well, no, we'll save it. We'll save it. We'll save it. You can hear something behind it. Oh, it's a wall. I thought that was a doorway. I'm not going to lie. Okay. So. Big curtain. <laughs> Flip the oh, here's a curtain. Okay. Move curtain. So. Flip this thing. Turn the valve. Oh, 
Okay, so maybe we flip this first. Now do it. Oh hell. I don't remember the note. Poisoned! Okay. If you run the filter pump behind the curtain with the incorrect pressure too high or too low, it will trigger the ventilator. Be careful. You can tighten the pressure using the valve handle. So guys, I went to go get a drink, came back, and I muted my mic on accident. So for like the next 12 or so minutes or however long, I have no mic audio at all. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! I know, bro. I know, it sucks. It schmucked. But I did a little voiceover, so hopefully, you know, it saved it. While I was walking around, I saw this weird bird-looking thing. It was like a cyborg crow thing. And there was a note that said something about this guy, like, designed it for his daughter or something. I don't know, bro. Anyways, I saw the valve puzzle, which basically just turns on the water filter and makes the water clear. Then that allowed me to see this little target in the water, so I shot it and the statue lady came out of the water with a bronze key. After I did the puzzle and took the key, I went outside and saw this guy. Loki was glad the mic didn't record my scream because it was bad and uh, gotta be honest, not manly. <laughs> Anyways, I went to my car to get some ammo because I thought, you know, I was gonna come back and kill this guy, right? No, bro. He was way too strong. I don't know what bro was made of, but for some reason, my dumbass thought, well, I'll go back and get some more ammo and try again. And then that's where I figured out where my mic was off. All right, come here, fucker. Come on. Come on. Come on, get closer, bitch. Oh, he's not dead. Bro, why is it taking so much ammo to kill him? I'm just gonna have to run around him. Grab the ammo, yep, 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 yep. Okay. I think he just regains his whole health after I leave, yeah. Okay, so I have a bronze key. I thought... Does that work? Oh, let's go! Okay! Wait. What the fuck? What the hell is this? Tall... Tolman's Records, June 3rd, 1986. What the fuck was that? Did I just hear something? I think we're good. We hired a company to start... I know I'm not tripping. Okay. Just hurry up. We hired a company to start uh, excavating. It didn't go to plan. Problem one, they spent too long sit, uh, setting up the site. Problem two, there was already a paper trail forming. The whole point was to do it quickly and quietly. And then the deal breaker, they started asking questions about the roots. They wanted to know full size and shape of the thing they were excavating. They wanted to know... Oh, holy fuck, that thing is scary. They wanted to know what it was made of. They wanted to know how long it had been there. No deal, obviously. They had to go. Okay, so... Freaking out, bro. Okay. That's an antidote in that bottle. We don't need that just yet. If you can't find the crank handle, it's because I borrowed it. I used it to hide that big egg shaped thing, or big egg shaped ruby inside the haunted manor. Afterwards, I locked the crank handle inside a safe in the southeast utility corridor. So, what does that mean? Oh, there's a trash can right here. Alright, yeah, banana peel. Fuck you. That looks like gas right there. Why can't we just... Is that the end? I can't really tell. Oh, it's a tank of gasoline! 
Oh, let's go. Okay. All right. Okay. So whatever's down there, we're going to lift up and fry, I'm guessing. Larger enemies have more health than smaller enemies. Consider this when making decisions about which ones to fight and which weapons to use. Oh, shit. So this is going to be a big enemy. That's what I'm going to get. A large metal tank. So, if we're looking at the map, north, east, south, west. So it would be... I think we go to Crow Country. Go back down. I would think so because a new enemy spawned in there when I went back through, and I don't think you're really supposed to go back through until like right now. So maybe this is where we need to be. Oh shit, hurry up. Okay. Okay, the haunted manor. So, is this, is this it? What the hell was that sound? Hello? Uh, what are you doing? Trying to get through this door? Oh, right. Is it locked? Obviously. Um. Okay. A soda can. Tough. Please be careful around the Haunted Manor bookcases. Read the book titles carefully. In fact, it'd be easier if you just didn't touch them at all, okay? Okay. I mean, you're gonna ask me twice. It's a face. He's smiling at me. Gross. Take it. I couldn't move it. What the hell is that? A grenade? Okay. My kit. Okay. Oh shit, there's a zombie. Oh. Fucker. Five bullets left. Okay. So we gotta start shooting some of these. Get some ammo, maybe. Oh, let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Yep. Shut up, you stupid, stupid bird. Okay. Trash can. Anything? Soda can. Okay. Oh, there's ammo right there, too. Oh, let's go. Okay. Let's just go here. Descend. Oh my god. What? Oh my god! Okay. Oh! Holy Jesus! Um... Uh... Turn the... Oh my god! I don't know what to do. I don't get it. Tur maybe turn the head inside? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Like, like that? Solomon Wellsby? 1855 to 1909. Um... Norbert Elsley. These are all... The same last name, Selena. No, not the head. Estella. Whole place will probably be flooded soon. What do you mean? I don't get it. If any of the kids have trouble disabling the trap, you can offer this advice. When reading the gravestone, focus on the names, the date of births, and the death dates aren't any use to you. Look at the floor in the center of the room. Wait, 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 what did it say? Hold on, hold on. When uh, reading the gravestone, focus on the names. The dates aren't even any use to you for now. East. 
This one needs to go east. I get it. Is that right? I don't know. South? That's right. Wait, maybe they need to be like straight though. Straight east. Hold on. Yeah. South. South. North. Oh no, that's that's northeast. Yep. South. This one was wrong, I think. <clears throat> Southwest, yep. There we go. Give me that shotgun. Oh, okay. Wait, the, the shotgun was fucking fake. <sighs> Here lies Ophelia, tragically drowned, daughter, sister, human. What do you mean, human? Oh my god! Holy Jesus! What the hell are you? Okay. Okay. There we go. Give me the fuck out of here. Okay. Hey Ed, what's been going on? I finally set up the address you can send me the ore. If you label the contents as samples of geological interest, we can pass it as an academic research thing. I'll collect the shipments once a week and take them back into the mine. Hold on to your hat. We're about to become the luckiest gold miner since 1848. So wait. This company, Crow Country, is not even like... Is it even... A, it doesn't even matter if it's a theme park. They're using it as like a mining place, I think. So they're like a mining company, but... Oh, I can... Yo, I can get a save here. Let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> nice. Have a save point now. Alright. What is this? Okay, that's nothing. Okay, that's just staff memos. Okay, so this is another safe room, I'm guessing. Chandelier traps hanging from the ceiling. Oh, shit. Wait, what'd that say? Set them off with a distance with a single handgun bullet. They'll damage enemies, too. Okay. Glossy magazine. It's an adult magazine. Oh, okay. So somebody was, uh... He ain't getting shit in here. <clears throat> Nothing. Cool. Yeah, I think this is another safe room. Can I get something else out of the trash can? Okay. Tom B. Stone, the year Selena died. Is this some kind of clone? Um, didn't I see that name somewhere else just a minute ago? Who, Selena? Solina. What the hell is that? Hell no, I ain't pulling it. <clears throat> Selina. The year Selina died. Oh, okay, I know what it is. We go back down here. That's not Selena. That's not Selena. That's not Selena. Selena. 1805 to 1872. So 1872. Okay. 1872. Let's go. Oh, it's a crank handle. Let's go. I'm gonna pull this bitch. Okay. Move. Oh. 
Oh, it's you. <laughs> I went through the crypt. There was a tombstone puzzle and a shotgun and this ticking clock. Okay, I didn't ask for your life story. Bitch, shut up. Fuck. Don't say sorry to this bitch. Oh. Oh. I'm just kidding, you did good, alright. Oh, okay. Um. Sorry. So you start off by looking at the adult magazines. What are you doing? Yeah, I think this is the best spot. Best spot for what? I assume he uses that elevator so he'll, you, he'll see it for sure. You're talking about Edward Crow? Yeah. Oh. Hey, would you help me out with something? What do you want? Sure. Sure, what do you want me to do? Clear off these tables and then lay some documents. Okay. It won't take but a minute. That'll do it. Thanks for the help. For the attention of Edward Crow. That takes care of that. Hopefully he'll see it. While I'm here, I'm going to take a look at in the cell. Okay. Did you go in? I didn't know. See, probably for the best. Well, catch you later. Stay out of trouble, alright? Okay. <sighs> Medical report. Patient, Elaine Marshall. Date of birth, 7-5-1973. Injuries. Wound across the stomach and chest. Not healing due to bacterial infection. Ooh, that sucks. Attempts to identify the nature of the bacteria are still ongoing. Suspected cause of injury. Attacked by a wild animal. Of unsubstained... <sighs> what more do you want from me? <laughs> oh my... Unsubstantiated, I think. Claimed by the patient that she was attacked by a person. Oh, okay. <laughs> Treatment. Ongoing treatment of the bacterial infection. Currently no improvement shown. Notes. Patient on uh, patient also complains of an ongoing headaches and qu uh, queasiness. Further treatment pending legal agreement between Marshall family and a third family financer. Dr. Margaret Fielding, Atlanta Westview Hospital. Okay. Oh, this is like evidence. The Atlanta Globe, July 1988 incident at local theme park. Fuck. <sighs> Parents Luke and Patricia Marshall decided to take their daughter Elaine to a local theme park for her 15th birthday, Crow Country. Named for its owner, one Edward Crow, is a small amusement park found only a few miles southeast of Atlanta. It's fair to say that it's been fairly popular with the locals, but we never really drew in the but never really drew in the big crowds of some of its smaller or larger competitors. The Marshall family were walking through a haunted, the haunted hilltop. Oh, that's where we're at. Section of the theme park when Elaine became separated from her parents. Around half an hour later, Elaine reappeared. She was visibly very upset, and a patch of blood marked the front of her t-shirt. It seemed Elaine had wandered into a restricted section of the park and encountered something or someone very dangerous. Yesterday, Atlanta Central Radio got a direct quote from Elaine herself speaking from her ward at Westview Hospital. There was a man in a cage. Okay, it's a photo. That must be like Elaine or something. Business card, Julie Barron, locally feared lawsuit. Attorney, 404-555-0129. Okay, what is this? Fatal error. Yeah, we're gonna leave that. <sighs> All right, guys. I think that does it for episode one. We did a lot. Um, you know, this is probably gonna be about an hour anyway. It's just, or maybe even longer. This footage is extensive. But I'm trying to get longer parts of this video because this game looks cool. You know, I'm definitely gonna come back for a part two. So, you know, stay in tune for that. But uh, anyways, though, that's the end of the video. I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.